Small and local businesses all around the world are being forced into a digital transformation. Fortunately, there are hundreds of digital marketing tools to support this transition and growth online in 2020. Hey team, Stuart here, welcome back. I hope everyone is doing well. Today, I wanna share with you our top 10 free digital marketing tools to grow your small business online in 2020. Today, we are all living in unprecedented times with the ongoing changes and challenges of our business environment. For small and local businesses, businesses all around the world, this means we need to change and adapt the way that we market and sell our products and services, as well as how we operate our businesses in general. Therefore, in today's video, we're going to dive into the top 10 free digital marketing tools to grow your small business online in today's fast changing business environment. Now, before we jump in, and if you get value from this video, then please give it a like and leave a comment down below. And if you're new here today, consider subscribing to stay updated with actionable videos designed to help your small business thrive online. And with that said, let's get started. Okay guys, so the first digital marketing tool that we believe is essential for small and local businesses is called MailChimp. Now with this tool, you can simply create and build your email list. You can also easily build a landing page with MailChimp, which offers a simple drag and drop landing page builder to easily capture emails and other information from your audience. You also can simply create campaigns to send to your audience whenever you like with this simple easy to use drag and drop builder. Now the great thing about MailChimp is it's easy to set up for beginners, it's free and you have access to many essential features for building an online audience. The second essential digital marketing tool is called Google My Business. This tool is one of the most important marketing tools for local businesses. Once you've created a free Google My Business listing and added all your business information, then your target audience can find your business on Google Search and Google Maps when typing in keywords related to your business, product, or services. This is ultimately gonna drive the majority of your leads, phone calls, sales through to your business. Google My Business is ex an extremely powerful tool for local businesses. Now, I will add a link above which will take you to a video tutorial guiding you through how to set up and optimize your Google My Business listing. The third digital marketing tool I want to highlight today is called Canva. Now, this is an online design tool aimed at small businesses or business owners with little to no design experience. Now, with Canva, you can quickly and easily create business materials for free from logos, flyers, presentations, posters, social media content, and more. The list goes on. You can create essentially anything with Canva. Now, Canva is the best all-in-one design tool for small businesses businesses. We highly recommend you give Canva a go if you're considering creating your own business materials because rather than paying big bucks to agencies, you can actually create a lot of this content, this uh, a lot of the business materials yourself and Canva offers free materials so that you can essentially not just build from scratch, but you can build off already pre-made professional templates. And all you need to do is change the text, some of the images and elements that Canva has already used. So it's a fantastic platform to get started with design and save money and create your own business materials. The fourth digital marketing tool is important for understanding your website performance. This is called Google Analytics. Now, many people don't bother with Google Analytics because they think the data will be too difficult to interpret. However, Google Analytics makes it super easy to understand what is happening on your website. From breaking down the traffic sources, your audience, location, age, gender, and how your website pages are performing online. Now, if you want to learn more about understanding your website analytics, then click the link above for our beginner's tutorial on Google Analytics. The fifth vital tool is called Uber Suggest by Neil Patel. Now, this digital marketing tool is used for understanding keywords in your market and your website domain. For example, if you type in your website domain name here, you can see an overview of how your website is performing. Here we can see the number of keywords that your website appears for, as well as the amount of organic or free website traffic that your website receives on a monthly basis. We can see the level of traffic per month and how high your website ranks in search engines like Google. In April, you can see that three 
keywords people search on Google, your website will appear in the first to third position on Google. This is where you want to be as around 31% of clicks go to position one on Google. Being on top is super important. You can also see the top pages by country and the keywords that people are typing in to find your website online, as well as the volume of searches per month, your ranking and visits. And you can see all your keywords down here. This keyword tool is vital for market research and understanding your website performance. The sixth digital marketing tool that we want to talk about today is called Facebook's Ad Library. Now, if you're not actively using Facebook to grow your business, now is the best time to get started. The Facebook Ad Library allows you to spy, to ethically spy, on your competition and see what images, videos, or text copy they are using in their ads. Now, you can also identify the ads that they are using that are performing well by finding the ads that they have been running for the longest amount of time. This is a great tool to ethically spy and understand how you should be crafting your own Facebook ads. If you want to learn more about Facebook ads, check out the video above which guides you through a comprehensive checklist to making the most out of Facebook campaigns. The seventh digital marketing tool that we want to cover today to grow your small business online in 2020 is called Google Ads. Now this is a digital marketing activity called PPC, pay per click advertising using Google Ads. For small and local businesses, you can invest in paid traffic to your website. You can also set up goals like leads, phone calls and conversions and then target specific audiences, locations and keywords. The great thing about Google Ads is you pay per click, which means when someone shows interest in your ad and then clicks on your ad, that is when you pay. Now there are also other great tools that you can use like the Keyword Planner to identify relevant keywords to target within your Google Ads account. I will add an in-depth Google Ads tutorial above to help you get started with Google Ads. And it's important to note that you also have access to your metrics and performance data to interpret your your Google Ads ROAS return on ad spend to see if your ads are profitable. The eighth digital marketing tool that we want to cover today is called HubSpot CRM, Customer Relationship Management Software. Again, this is a free comprehensive marketing tool and platform that integrates with many other business tools. Now, HubSpot CRM is a free CRM that has many powerful features for small business growth. You can manage interactions with customers and prospects while also creating beautiful email templates and more. More. HubSpot CRM is an all-in-one marketing platform for small businesses. And as you're probably aware, the majority of CRMs are extremely expensive. The great thing about HubSpot CRM is it's completely free. However, if you do want to upgrade to use additional features, then you can upgrade at any time. The ninth digital marketing tool we want to talk about today is called Trello. Now this is a free productivity and project management software that is ideal for small businesses and their teams to collaborate on projects together. This tool allows for a fun and visual project management experience for both businesses and their clients. Simply create a project board add your team and start creating your project workflows. This is a great tool for teams that are based in different locations and must collaborate and work together online. For an in-depth tutorial which guides you through Trello, click the link above. This is a great tool to stay productive and connected with your team. The 10th and final digital marketing tool to grow your small business in 2020 is called Audience Insights within Facebook. This is a powerful research tool that will allow you to better understand your target audience. With this digital marketing tool, you can easily create an audience that you want to target with your Facebook ads. Audience Insights allows you to target your audience by location, age, gender and interest that your audience has, as well as more targeted options like relationship status, education, politics and more. This tool is vital for understanding exactly who your audience is that you want to target on Facebook and Instagram. It's also just a great tool to use to understand your audience and for market research.
And there we have it. Those are our top 10 free digital marketing tools to grow your small business online in 2020. Thank you for watching. If you got value out of this video, make sure to give us a like and leave a comment down below. And if you haven't done so already, make sure to subscribe and we will see you in next week's video. Take care.